Okay. Hang on. Oh shit. Hey, how's it going? <sighs> Got nine hours to drive, and then after Carolina Classic at 3 a.m. on Sunday, I'll be driving to fucking Neapolis for Naptown. So Naptown should be fun. A bunch of people I know over there. I got word that apparently we got some other members of the front row that won't be showing up at Carolina Classic at Naptown. So we got people that will not be traveling all the way to North Carolina, but instead be at the Naptown show instead. So it'll be fun. It's just uh, what the sheets are saying though. Who knows? It might be, uh, might be true, it might be false, who knows? It could be anything. But yeah, I gotta get on the highway and then we're gonna be shredding it nine hours pretty much. I really wish there was a fucking interstate that went northeast but there isn't i gotta go all the way to jacksonville again so i will see y'all on the road This uh, gas station. The receipt printer don't fucking work. Whatever, dude. But yeah, three hours and forty minutes left. I'll be there at like, holy fuck, midnight. Jesus Christ, why did I leave so late? Whatever, it's all good. Made it to the hotel. Uh, I have not vlogged a single bit of this. Um, yeah, pretty much just waiting on Maddie to get here, and then I don't know. Probably gonna go to sleep after driving for six hours after her work day. So, yeah. Well, I made it. Caleb's there. You know, we moved up from BMVs, you know? We're at a motel now. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we definitely moved up. Yeah, hey, I'm moving up. So, you know, BMV is usually like 150 a night, which is okay to split with five, eight different people. Mm -hmm. it's, it's just me and Caleb now, so. Yeah. It's not bad, though, for $60 a night. I don't see any visual stains besides the floor but it's whatever you know. yeah and there's then, also that door that i'm pretty sure goes into the room right there does it pretty sure that's funny considering there's a lock on it oh yeah maybe so what if we open it i'd, I'd rather not <laughs> <laughs> you know how you know that uh that you're in a bad motel when they don't physically deliver to it I had to physically drive to this McDonald's in order to get the food. It was two miles away. There is no reason that I wouldn't be able to get it delivered. Besides it, uh, this area being blocked off because of sketchy shit. But yeah, this is going to be the last bit, I think, for the uh, rest of the day. Because I'm going to go to sleep right after I eat this. Because I'm tired as hell. <sighs> well, it's DPW day. About that time. About that time. Got this, hey, how would you describe it? Shitty motel? Shitty little dingy ass hotel. Yeah. <laughs> this floor over here is literally coming up. Oh yeah, I was gonna do some 120 FPS shots, but uh, look at the luggage track for moving there below it. Mm. That's cool. Yeah. Yeah. It's probably gonna be a short vlog today since it's just the two of us. If I can do that right, yeah, there we go. Uh, I don't know. We might try to find something to do. There's plenty of stuff to do in Durham, especially at the convention center. I think there's like food there too, so we can eat. Like, they got food. Yeah, they got like a restaurants they over there. Eat down there? Maybe if some of the boys get done with work early and they can relax a little bit before the show, might meet up with Tyler and them if if possible. I I'm hang out with them after the master show. Yeah, definitely hang out with the master show, but yeah. if they got time, I don't know. Yeah. But we'll see. Mm. We got time with blue. So, turns out there's uh, nothing to do in Durham. Not really, no. Yeah. So, watching planes land out, it's crazy. 
Got to watch this one take off, maybe. Maybe. Or for lucky. I'm pretty sure it's gonna go all the way down that way. All right, well, I got a hold of GoPro now, so. No way. Uh, <laughs> we decided uh, we saw like four planes take off on one land, and we're like, okay, yeah, we've kind of seen enough of this shit. <laughs> so. Do you enjoy planes? We are gonna go get Maddie some sheets, because instead of getting food the first time, like probably should have, we're gonna go do it now. Listen, I wasn't hungry at the time. <laughs> I saw Neither pitch, was I. I saw Pitch Black Mountain Dew. I was like, oh shit. I Turn this left forever. onto the ramp to US Shut up. No, but I wasn't hungry and I saw I, I hyper focused on Pitch <laughs> like, Black Mountain Dew. I was like, oh you shit. You focused so hard on the Mountain yeah. Dew flavors. I was looking at it. I was like, this is so fucking <laughs> rare. I don't ever see this shit. Yeah. But no, fucking. Apparently, she's had chicken and fries and I was not aware of this. Yeah. So. Yeah, she's got a lot of stuff. Yeah. Nobody's farming me. I'm, I'm, about to, I'm about to anger a lot of Carolinians with it, but uh, some of it's pretty well mid. Yeah? Should we go somewhere else? No, 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 sheets is fine. Okay. I've only tried like three different things there. And granted, you can like create it how you want it. So, okay. it may just be the combination of shit I got made it mid. It or really it could be the location. Because I, I know with like plenty of restaurants, it depends on location some of the time. Listen, I'll be honest. The, uh, the Mountain Dew labels are peeling the fuck off. On that fountain, so it might just be the location. Yeah. Could be, yeah, it could I'm be. I'm hoping my food is not mid because I'm gonna be pretty fucking mad. Yeah, I mean, at least it'll be substance no matter what, so it just won't be tasty substance. <laughs> How do you fuck up fried chicken? I don't know, man. It's actually like kind of impressive if I see a restaurant fuck up fried chicken. <laughs> Welcome to Front Row Food Reviews. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> dude, I had so many fucking people like on my way in last night. I had like two or three cars. I was going, I was going to speed limit, which at the time was like 65, maybe 70. These motherfuckers were going like 90 and 100, like the, like the... <laughs> Homeboy fucking vibing over there, dog. <laughs> oh god, the random shit you can catch when you're actually filming. I was expecting them to do like fucking tricks and everything, I was expecting them to like just wheelie up the way. He was hitting the gritty. <laughs> he was hitting the gritty on the bike. Yeah, I had like, you know some of those videos you see on like TikTok or somewhere where it's just like somebody catching somebody driving past them on the highway and they're like speeding mm -hmm. in between everyone? Yeah, I had that motherfucker hit, like almost hit my fucking back end last night. Oh my god. Like, I had the same dudes from Two Mustangs that shit. Yeah, it was, oh god. Yeah, motherfucker about took out my entire left side. I was about to, I was, whoo, okay. People don't know how to drive. Sure. Learn how to fucking drive. If you get that reference, you're a real one. Everyone says that. What's the reference? What's it's, the bit? It's a Leonard Kenny reference. Oh. Had to get the atomic blue, which I never am able to get ever in my life, ever. Yeah. We out here in Sheets waiting mm -hmm. my order. Where else is it? There it is. Hello, welcome to our Sheets food review. <laughs> I joked about it. We're actually doing it. We're doing a food review of Sheets. Do this. So what did you get? I got chicken and fries. Okay, so you just got it's like the curly fries, little baby ass cup. So, so it's hot as hell. Okay, so you just got simple, pretty much. Uh, very basic. If you fuck it up, you're an idiot. <laughs> I got a uh, some boneless wings. Boner wings. It's boner wings. Um, mixed with Dr Pepper barbecue sauce. Now what the fuck is wrong with your brain? <laughs> I saw it. I've been seeing it like the last two times I stopped at the sheets. I'm like. Might as well give it a fucking shot. I saw it when I was scanning by too, and I was like, I don't know. I don't think so. I mean, it's Dr. Pepper, so it has to be at least. Okay, I think it. Tolerable. That actually doesn't smell as bad as the bag did. It smells too sweet for me. It might, it might be just a little bit too sweet, but we're gonna give it a try here. So, God, this thing is wet as fuck. Make my car a fucking mess. Car not cool. You know the funniest thing about us mouthing the camera like that? I moved the car even once that turns out fall. Yeah. Oh shit, okay. The fry is good. That's got a little bit of a kick to the it. Chicken reminds me of like cookouts. Mm-hmm. Alright, that, that that's got a bite to it. Alright then. That that's gonna make spicy? me spicy? That's gonna make me sweat. Is it spicy? <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. I wouldn't expect Dr. Pepper to be spicy. Dr. Pepper is spicy. It's like spicy spray. We need to get a McDonald's Sprite fucking sauce. 
Does the Madonna part really hit that much different? It's the carbonation. Really? Yeah. The fart and fountain carbonation is crazy. Weird. Mm -hmm. Mine's really good. Yeah, yeah, mine's not too bad. I mean, it's got a little bit of a kick, but it's not too bad. We were sitting there shitting on it while we were waiting on it. <clears throat> it's fine. I'm going to give it a try with the honey mustard sauce because I got honey mustard dipping sauce with it, so we'll see how we'll see how this goes. Oh boy, you're going crazy. That, that's gonna be a this you is gonna are be a, going crazy this style. Is, this is a fucked up combination of flavors. This is crazy. You're gonna die, actually. This is how you die. It's actually not bad. Surprisingly yeah. enough, that's not a bad combination of flavors. Does it make it less spicy? A little bit. It actually kind of melts it out a little bit. Mm. No slider or not. <laughs> just pour the honey salt on the straw. Just, just go and pour it back in here, close it, and just shake it up again real quick. Make sure you shake it up while you're uh, not holding on to it <laughs> in my car. I will say for a gas station, this is pretty fucking good. Mm -hmm. I think this might be better than Whataburger's tenders, to be honest. I have not tried water burger, so I could not uh, confirm or deny that. Plus, I haven't had a bite of them either, so. What's that? Plus, I haven't tasted them, so. Oh, uh, water burger? Yeah. Water burger tenders or those tenders. They're really good. They're like flaky. Kinda also, like yes, for anybody wondering, yes, I'm the guy that sucks my fucking fingers off with sauce, okay? Shut up. You need a napkin? I got some napkin. No. <laughs> no, I actually prefer this way. Okay. Get a little bit extra flavor out of it. Just a little bit of COVID. Just a slight taste of cannibalism. Just on yourself. Yeah, you're getting COVID that way, bro. <laughs> good? Yeah. Mine is too. I'd probably give it about... <clears throat> hmm. If I wasn't expecting the kick, if I knew what it was probably going to taste like, I'd probably give it about an 8. But with honey mustard, I'd, nah, I'd probably put it about an 8 still. I do 8.5 Wait, for all my total. <clears throat> yeah. All right, welcome to the, <laughs> the, the... This was the first inaugural of Front Row Food Reviews. Holy shit. You get a crunchy bit? I got a super crunchy bit. Holy shit. Going crazy. I would drive nine hours for this. I would not drive six hours for this. <laughs> <laughs> the only reason I would not drive six hours for this is because there's a Bucky's like an hour away from me. So, because if I'm gonna go to a get like a big restaurant gas station, mm -hmm. I'm going to a closer one. That's fair. That that's my only logical reasoning for that. I think the closest sheets for me is like Jacksonville. I'm pretty sure the closest sheets for me is like an hour west of Durham. <laughs> no so, way. Like, so like most of my fucking drive is the closest sheets. Holy shit. I'm almost positive, at least. I know she's for sure is in Orlando, though. Yeah. Thinking on it now. That's a crazy as hell trip. You drive three hours to go to a Sheets, which is a fucking gas station. You get gas and you drive back. <laughs> <laughs> I will not be doing that. <laughs> All right, see you later. <laughs> it's like, hey, guys, this is DPW weekend. You might be thinking I'm heading out this way. No, nah, I'm just going to get some Sheets. No, I'm, I'm, I'm heading back home sheets. directly afterwards. <laughs> My entire six-hour drive is just me getting Sheets and heading home. I don't, I don't have a ticket or anything. I didn't pay my part for the B&B. Nah, I'm just heading home after this. That's insane. <laughs> Fucking nuts. Ain't no way. Where the fuck is Brian? <laughs> I don't know. Yes, reiterate 8.5 for me. Are you done? Uh, I'm saving mine for later. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, probably gonna eat some more whenever we get ready to go to the venue. We're getting ready now. It's almost four. Yeah, I know. I can still, I can finish the rest of that off in 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Yeah, I finish the food otherwise I'll eat while I'm driving and that's not Wor safe. Worst case, I spent the money on it. If I throw it away, I throw it away. No way. I gotta eat the rest of this otherwise I'll fucking die. Hey, Swan. <laughs> what? Is that thing so on? <laughs> yeah, it is. Still recorded. We haven't actually closed it out yet. <laughs> I thought we did. No. Fuck. Huh. You can cut it wherever you want on this. I'll cut mid sentence. <laughs> <laughs> cut mid sentence of us. Good. Okay, so we found Tenshi. Um, I tell him I don't like pizza, and this is what happens. Yeah. So, so Maddie doesn't like pizza, and Tenshi is having a fit on the floor. So. Yeah. Yeah. 
This happens every time so small. <laughs> Oh, we made it. So it's about starting about five or so. A lot of people out here tonight. I think almost uh, all the seats are filled. Should be a fun show. It's like, hey, let's drive back tonight. Yeah. Well, you motherfuckers are driving all the way to fucking Indianapolis. Yeah, I'm driving back to anywhere. I gotta go drive to Indianapolis. Yeah. Well, that's what I'm saying. You guys are driving. Your drive is basically the same as mine right now. Eight and a half. Okay, add two, two and a half more hours. Okay, shut up. Okay, shut up. Long drives ahead. Yeah. I'll be honest. I, uh, I like the show a lot. The, the actual context of the show was good. The context was great. The, uh, but the, j just the vibe and the way everybody the vibe felt was, was a little off. Yeah, yeah the vibe was off. Um, it may have been more just because all of us weren't there, but it kind of felt more than that a little bit. All of us weren't there, but also it felt like the crowd weren't it. Just, you know, how much you can do about that. But the crowd was Wait. popping for the pasta. It was popping for it for sure, but like it was... Uh, you could hear a fucking pin drop sometimes. Yeah, there was there was the usual quiet moments. There some of the typical matches that are 
quiet. Yeah. Like some most of the women's matches. Uh, Actually, I thought Janai Kai fucking killed the, it. Janai Kai one was good. Yeah. Uh, the other women's match, fuck. Amy and May. Yeah. Oh, that, that was great. That, that one it also had some down moves though. They uh they had a second win. Oh yeah. I'm gonna put my ship in the car and I guess we're gonna Tyler. Apparently we're going uh somewhere for a little bit and then we will fuck off to Indianapolis. This will probably be the end of the DPW vlog and get excited for the Daptown vlog. Please be excited. Here. Please. I'm begging you here. Maddie Maddie's begging. I know everybody's gonna be excited, it'll be fine. Listen, <laughs> Josh, Mikey, Tyler. Somebody yes, else got, haven't we got have a name the Delinquents are back. We got the delinquents at the next one. That's awesome. Right, we're gonna get out of here.